Warning. The following Let's Play features horribly timed singing. Viewers may wish to plug their ears now. Hello, everybody! My name is Dude, and welcome back to Undertale! Ah, it has been a little bit of a while for me, because I had to videograph a wedding. And, uh... Mm. Okay. I'm gonna need to switch, uh... Hang on. I'm gonna have to show something. Okay. This is what just happened to my window. This is what happened to my game window. Just, just a heads up. <laughs> okay. Undertale the musical. Go! I don't know if I'll put the mustache on again. That was a little hard to do. Could it be? Oh god, what? My watch roll! Oh, well, that just makes the voice funnier. You look bored, Johnny. I want to miss your performance, so if you'll get, well, give us your all, then I'll skip ahead for the audience to say. Farm? <laughs> sure, I'll do it. Let us die. Let's knock him down! Oh god. <laughs> I don't know if I can take this seriously. <laughs> I really don't know if I can take this seriously. I shouldn't. Oh my love! Please run away! Okay. You can't let me. Monster King! Forbids your stay! Woman's must! Can I climb? No. But if breaks my heart, and you, my dungeon, it's all it's like, <laughs> and then you'll die a lot. I wish I the words popped up a little sooner. I cry. So sad it's happening. Okay. Aw, that was beautiful. I butchered it, but that was beautiful. So sad. So sad you're going in a dungeon. Okay. Well, toodles! Oh boy! Oh no, whatever shall I do? Oh wow, your your flame's pink. I don't have to put the mustache on! Yay! Why well, love the big cast away and the dog friend? The dog with the puppets are just led by Paramar Wolves, well, are they Paris? Wait, what? Oh, the rabbits have mercy at the horrible color tile bag! Each color tile has its own statistic function. Wait, what? For example, a green tile sounds a noise, and then you must fight a monster. That was well. Actually, wait a sec. I was in this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago. Oh god, I do have to do it. I have to do it. No, I don't. No, I don't. <laughs> don't put. No. Oh god. Okay. Red, I can't pass. Pink, I can. Green makes a noise. Blue, I think, is piranhas. Orange. If I touch an orange, you don't get through this in thirty seconds. Oh. Considering by these jets of fire. Oh god. I'm all alive, I'm so filled with grief, I can't stop laughing! <laughs> good luck, darling. Oh god. Okay. Pink is good, red I can't pass, green makes a noise, I gotta fight a thing. Eh. Eh. Damn it. Damn it, I gotta... Eh. I'm trapped now. I am quite literally trapped. Oh god damn it. Wait. Oh shit. I'm trapped. I'm literally trapped. Oh god damn it. Grub the flag, darling. Um, Alphys? 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 That would be... 
a good time to turn off the fire. Or that. A lot of coffee. All right. Watch out, I'll save you. I'm hacking into the firewall right- Thank you. <sighs> Thank you, Alphas. I will come to your wedding with Undyne. Because we know it's gonna happen. I will make it happen. Just for this. Oh no, Alphas is happening. Well, look out for the really Dr. Alpha. Was this all for show or something? That's right! Go on, man. I got my boy out of here. We'll never be able to defeat him. You know what? Dude, just put a, a pink mustache on Alphys' face whenever I'm doing that accidentally. <laughs> right, right, we work together. You're Puzzle Silver. I got all the levers to work. Puzzle? I'll work? Alpha Jolly, what are you talking about? Did you forget all the green tiles do? I make a sound and you have to fight him. Monster is oh oh I have to oh so I can't attack I can't attack him oh god Alphys not a rat right? it seems bad but don't worry there's one last thing I installed on your phone see that yellow button go to this phone's act menu and press it got it yellow yellow button does. Time's present. Yeah, darling, say goodbye. What? 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 I press Z. Oh! Oh! This became more bullet healthy. Alrighty. Whoa! Whoa! You've defeated me! I'm gonna bet you're stronger than I thought it said. Bye bye! I, I just picture, like, Bugs Bunny or something. <laughs> we know you're running for us, but now we have to go! I, I just picture him <laughs> He would totally do it, too. You did a really great job out there. Thank you. All thanks to you. What? Oh, no, I mean, you were the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs. I wouldn't have gotten anywhere if it weren't for you! Don't sell yourself short! Don't do it! Um, hey, this might sound strange, but... Can I tell you something? Before I met you, I, I didn't really... I didn't really like myself very much. I could tell. You wanna talk about it? Are you gonna talk about it? A long time, I, I felt like a total screw-up. Like I couldn't do anything without... without ending up letting everyone down. But, but... Fighting you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So, thanks for letting me help you. Hey, no problem. Anyway, we're almost to the core. We just passed MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. Got it. I'm really glad I didn't have to do that puzzle. Holy shit. What? Is there a thing that I get for solving it? Hi, it's the ice cream dude. An ice cream dude. This is excellent here. These two fellas bought all my ice cream. I knew there was a reason I shipped you two! And the internet! The internet ships you two. Hey, I've still got something for you. A big smile, how about... Get out. Where's the... Wait, what? That, that was the way out of the place? Yeah, it's Heat's Flamesman, right? Did you? Yes. What? You remember? How could I be so easily defeated? I'll always remember that you remembered. Why wouldn't I remember you? You told me like an episode ago. Or two. I forget. Is there a save point, or do I have to go back? Sans! How's it going, buddy? Why did you go out of the court? How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Sure. Hey! Thanks for treating me. Oh, am I... Am I over here. I know a shortcut. Another one? Oh boy. Where are we going? Oh, here we are. So, the journey's almost over, huh? I think so. I mean, how far... I don't know how far the core is exactly, but... Okay. I just really want to go home. Not really. I mean, I've met so many awesome monsters. I'd stay, personally. As long as they'd let me. Yeah, I know the feeling, buddo. My name's Dude. Actually, no. My name's Leslie, technically. Oh, 
Maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here you've already got food, drink, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? Well, not really. Like I said, I would stay. I don't know about Wesley. Ah, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Thanks, Sans. Hey, let me tell you a story. So I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? You are? Then why'd you let me go? Sit there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door. It was perfect for practicing knock-knock jokes. Oh. Wait. I came out of a locked door. You've been using that for knock-knock joke practice? Really? So one day, I'm knocking them out. Like usual. I knock on the door and I say knock-knock. Suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Is it Toriel? Because that's the only woman I know on the other side of that door. Who's there? So naturally I respond, Dishes. Dishes who? Dishes a very bad joke. Sans. I should just be getting used to this, I suppose. And she just howls with laughter. Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. Probably was, she's lived in there for so long. She might get lonely. So I keep him coming and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. And after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I didn't know you could yodel. <laughs> yeah, that's Tario. Definitely Toria. <laughs> wow. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. Pyrus gets kind of cranky without his bedtime story. Eh. <laughs> I'd ask what kind of stories you tell him, but... Eh. I don't think I have the time for, the, for any more than just the one. She told me to come by again, so I did. And I did again. And again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door. It rules. Sure it does. Especially when the door talks back. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked what was up. Then she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? What? I hate making promises. And this woman, I don't even know her name. But someone who sincerely likes bad jokes <coughs> excuse me. Is an integrity you can't say no to. You get what I'm saying? I think I do. You didn't do your job because of her. The promise I made to her. You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? I do. I do. You'd be dead where you stand. I know. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking. No, you're not. No, you're not, Sans. Don't even try. But thank you. Besides, Ev, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I guess so. I mean, I still have to come into fights, though. I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. Bullshit! What's that supposed to mean? Don't you question me! I died all the time! I died from Muffet! I died from Toriel once! I think I died from... No, I did die from Papyrus, but not. it wasn't actually death. It was more like he captured me. Um, where else did I die? 
I think that was it. Am I wrong? Yes. Yes, you are, but that's okay. I mean, I have my own way of getting around it. That's fine. <laughs> um, well, that's all. Take care of yourself, kid. Someone really cares about you. Even after I left, really? Even after I left the place, she still cares? Can I call her? Darling. Shit. <sighs> came and I realized I forgot to make a reservation. But I didn't want to look like I messed up, so I kept walking in anyway. Now I'm just kinda consuming dew off the spikes. That's ah, weird, and I'm gonna walk away. Then again, what's normal? Really, what is considered normal? I'm just gonna find the safe point. Wow. That's heavy. Relaxing atmosphere of this hotel. Fills you with determination. Sure. That's pretty heavy, man. <laughs> this guy looks worried. What's up? I'm not gonna be home tonight. Um, I think there's some cold pizzas in my treasure hoard you can heat up. What? I'm gonna go straight to the capital, but it stopped working. The hotel's doing its best to accommodate everybody stuck here. Oh. Oh! So they're from the capital and they're stuck. Okay. So they're just commuters, then? I mean, that would make sense, but why would you commute by elevator? So... Whoa. Hey, buddy, how you doing? You okay? Oh, okay, I'll leave you alone. So Sans would have killed me if Toriel didn't say anything. I don't know how to take that. Hey, go up the creepy alleyway on the right for some great deals. Um, we'll do that next time, because I got a lot to think about now. It's pretty heavy stuff. What the... Okay, say one more time, maybe get a little wet. That is not getting wet. Okay, whatever. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And thank you to TKaru and ShubShub for supporting me on Patreon this month. I will see you guys in the next video. And hopefully, it won't be as depressing as this episode ended up being. <laughs> this shit, man. Sans hit me like a ton of bricks, dude. It's like, shit, that is definitely Toriel he talked to. That is definitely Toriel. There, I didn't see any other locked doors, did you? <laughs> Shit. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye! Oh my god, things are even crazier. You have a thing on your butt. You have a little root. What?